Let's talk about the 300. You got it. All right, so 300. Back to the bigger chassis as, yep. as it was before. We're going to fit the widest range of handicap into this. Yep. I, can get, I can get a scratch golfer all the way up to a 30 handicap in this, no problem, depending on what they're looking to do with it. All right, so what do you expect out of this thing? Let me, let me guess, just guess here. On a 7-iron, 110, I'm going to say 112 plus another. I'm going to say this will be... 117 to 120, is that we, fair? We saw 120 out of the T200, ball speed. We could see one. Could on see a seven iron? Yeah, on the seven iron. Okay. That was what's also so cool about that 200. We okay. could see 123, 122. Wow, did that get up in the air. <laughs> I caught it just a little fat. Right, look at the ball speed with a little fat shot. Yeah. Ooh. What'd you get on that? How about a 165 carry? Flight miss. Yeah. <laughs> so here's your, your your heel to toe forgiveness. What a feel that was. That feels so solid. Looks brilliant. Oh, oh. pretty good there. Ball move. Pretty good. Got to keep riding that damn thing. When it's moving, don't hit it. Wow. This is it, baby. Yeah. This is really, this is helpful. Well, it's getting up in the air, which is awesome. I still wasn't quite, I, I didn't quite get it. It's almost like I'm putting a bigger product in your hand and you're having trouble focusing in on that. On that seat, right? I, I, well, what I'm doing is I'm staring at the club, not at the ball. <laughs> that was mustard. That was it. I got it. What is amazing to me is how good it is when it's bad. Right, that's correct. That's, I mean, I only hit once really, you know, solidly. I caught that one pretty good. I wasn't unhappy with that. like you cut it, but the ball didn't want to move right at all. That was cool. 121 again. Yeah. Okay. Kind of can. <laughs> Remarkably consistent. Yeah, it's really good. To the good shots. With as bad.